Trident SA International Marketing Manager Simon Lewis discusses the developments of the company, particularly of the locomotives industry into Africa and South America. Just give us a bit of an insight into Trident SA, you know this alliance that you formed between Trident SA, BMG, Battery Electric and also in terms of the project work that you're currently undertaking and the expansion of the company. Okay, um, well first of all Trident SA and Battery Electric are in the same group with sister companies. Uh, we belong to a subgroup of Royal Buffeting Holdings called uh, Mining, Oil and Gas Services. Uh, what we're doing, what we traditionally have done is battery electric uh, make the control systems for our locomotives um, but we were never in the same group so there was always competition for the control of our locomotives in terms of the actual controllers now that we're in the same group we, we've decided to work uh, very closely together it's a very natural um, partnership uh, we, we, we're very very close with those guys we know them very well um, so we always were going to work together on controllers. The new projects that we're working with include um, BMG, Berryman Group, uh, specifically around locomotive braking systems. Uh, what we're doing there is we are using a, um, a BMG developed braking system, which we've, we've worked in combination with them to design uh, in our locomotives. Basically, what we want to offer the customer is the best that they can get in terms of a braking system. Um, there's a lot of competition out there, different braking systems, and we, f we feel this way, we can ensure that the braking of our locos remains at the right standard for the DMR, that kind of thing. So this way we ensure that we have control of what we put in the locomotives, and we can take that to market and hopefully you know, keep our, our locomotives at the cutting edge of, of, of where they should be. And I mean, obviously you're expanding your operations into Africa. Tell us a bit about your investment into Zambia and uh, new opportunities in South America. Within the next couple of months, we'll be uh, we'll begin manufacturing uh, in Zambia, in Kitwe. Uh, in, in we have a company up there called uh, Bateman Trident Engineering. Uh, what we will be doing there is basically uh, rewinding motors and producing motors for the the, uh, the locomotives in the, um, the copper belt. Uh, we have a lot of equipment up there already. We have a, quite a significant uh, manufacturer base up there. Um, and then into South America, we've, we've basically discovered that, uh, well, everyone really knew there was a huge amount of mining in South America. It's very similar to South African mining. Uh, not 100% the same, but very similar. Um, and, you know, we've got 150 odd units of um, of our other product, the rocker shovels, already in those mines. We're talking in places like Colombia, Bolivia, Peru, um, Ecuador. Uh, we're also looking at places like Chile, we're looking at Brazil, we're looking at Venezuela when it, when it becomes more politically stable. We have uh, Mexico as well. If you move into Central America, we have Nicaragua. We have a couple of units in Nicaragua. Uh, Mexico is a big expansion for us. That's much more similar to South Africa, a lot of silver mining, uh, bigger machines. And we've recently also had um, two units going up to back into the United States for a tunneling project in Miami. Lewis adds that Trident SA is also expanding its operations into Asia, particularly in the mining sector. For Engineering News, I'm Ilan Solomons, Wadeville, Germiston.